the overall memory for the Apollo guidance computer program was equivalent to 72K uh, uh, kilobytes, 72 kilobytes of uh, memory in modern terms. Today, a $100 MP3 player has 50,000 times more storage space. Furthermore, the computer disks that stored the programs were fragile and unreliable. The solution today seems extraordinary. It was called rope memory. You actually had to send the program to a factory and women in the factory would literally weave the software into this core rope memory. We called it the LOL method, the little old lady method of uh, wiring these, <laughs> these cores. Not a very nice, t today you couldn't say that. <laughs> say that. <laughs> Computer code consists of ones and zeros. In this case, it was a physical distinction. Margaret Hamilton was one of the very few female engineers on the project. The rope is made up of rings and wires. And if the wire goes through the core, it represents a one, and around the core, it represents a zero. It was extremely slow. One program could take several months to weave, and if there was an error, it was a nightmare to correct. The software program was falling dangerously behind schedule. 